Our athletic council gets together. I send out a mass email and I say, if you have a nomination for athlete of the year, would you please submit it with the little documentation? And uh, we will, as a council, discuss the merit of each of those, and then we will arrive at a decision. And this year, I think we had a no-brainer because uh, two people were nominated, and uh, actually three people were nominated, but after looking at it, they said that the choice is clear. First, I would like to nominate, I would like to recognize the male athlete, and I'm just gonna read what his coach wrote about him when he nominated him. Gotta be Victor Brown, boys tennis. Victor has been a baseline league champion and a baseline league MVP. If he wins it this year, which he should, this will be four years straight. He has lost exactly one set in four years of competitive tennis at Alcohoma High School. He went all the way to the singles final of CIF individuals in the, in the last two tennis players from all 587 CIF schools in the CIF Southern section, and he lost to the number one in the final match. We hope he's going to be going again. But this is what he says also. Victor is totally nominated. Not only should he win this award, but he may be one of the top five or 10 best athletes to ever come through Alcohol High School. And I think Carlos would agree. Next year, he's headed to BYU on a full scholarship, and in addition, Victor's a great guy. So our male athlete of the year is Victor Brown. Victor! Big Vic! And then finally, you think I'm just checking my text, but I'm getting on there where our soccer coach has sent me his, his word. So our, our soccer coach.